everybody! Today I'm going to show you how to do a project called Exquisite Corpse. This is something you can do by yourself or with family members. All you need is a piece of paper and some drawing utensils. I chose three different colored markers. The first thing you need to do is fold your paper into three sections. Start by folding your paper from the bottom up, just past the halfway point. Fold the top of the paper over like you're folding a letter. You should have a paper that looks like this. And when you open it up, there should be three sections. Each person will draw in each section a head, a body, and legs. In the first section, you're going to draw a head and start by drawing a neckline that goes over the folded line so that the next person has something to connect to. I'm going to start by drawing the head and you can draw whatever kind of creature, animal, or person you would like. Make sure you give it a face, and add some detail. When you finish drawing the head, you're going to fold your paper down so that the next person can't see what you drew and pass it along. The second person is going to begin drawing the body with the arms, belly, and chest. They're going to connect to the lines that were drawn by the person before them and they're going to do the same for the next person after them by drawing lines that connect over the fold. But for now, I'm drawing a dress. And don't forget to add the arms. I don't know what the person drew before me, so I'm just drawing whatever I want. And adding some detail. Now I'm drawing my legs just starting to go over that folded line for the next person to connect to. Hold your drawing down so the next person can't see and pass along. The third person is going to finish the drawing by connecting to those lines, drawing some legs, and some feet. Again, you can draw any kind of legs you'd like. It doesn't matter and don't be afraid to get silly. This project always comes out unique and goofy every time. I always like to add a little extra detail. So I'm gonna draw some flowers. When you're finished drawing the details, it's time for the big reveal. Everybody always gets super excited about this part. Let's see what we have inside by opening up our paper. This project seems to never get old and everybody always enjoys it. I hope you guys have fun. See you next time!